Oh god, Cure died. We might have to go save Scum. Because RNG! Unfortunately, the one downside with Monster Arena, it's all RNG. You could have the best team in the world and just RNG. But we might not survive the third round without Cure. G. That was so close. Alright, let's do this again, but hope that RNG does not continue to scream. RNG bus! Yes, that was that was who actually won that fight. It wasn't Murray, it was RNG bus. Pretty much the grand contender there. Me is gonna lay in bed. Ote dance. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give the team openers a big hat in the red corner. In the blue corner is a dream duo.
Yes, there we go. Insta kill the metal. Ooh, and another desperate attack. Nice. You know, that poor Skeletoid is probably s sitting there by himself just going like, Uh... I'm gonna die. This is not good. Well, at least, at least, you know, apparently that Gladiator is a true warrior because he put him to sleep. So that way he doesn't have to suffer through the slaughtering he's about to take. You know, I, I can appreciate that, you know? Allow the allow the poor man to die to die in his sleep, unaware of the miserable suffering he's about to go through. You know, that that's honorable. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh my god. Also me would like to be tucked in in a quibby. That would be nasty. Nice. Yeah. We got confettis. words. I really don't know what to say. I suppose I should give you your prize, eh? <laughs> Here you are! A dragon robe? That sounds incredibly helpful. Ragazzo. With my passy and my stuffing that kiss on my forehead. Now, I must call you champion, eh? <laughs> day without the failure, I am here in arena, striving to make the better monster team. In my mind, all I am thinking is how to make the team stronger, how to give it more gusto. But I am nothing compared to you, champion. Grazie. You really make my dream come true. I've been waiting for this day. For the momentous day, I finally find the hair of my monstrous pit. Does this mean that if they have another monster arena in later games, we're going to see the main hero from this game? Let me give you one. Oh Let gosh, that would be kind of cool. That would be. Take a look at the place where we first met. Because he did say air to his monster arena. And the guy's already old to begin with in this game. It wouldn't surprise me if by like, you know, by that point in the timeline, he's already past of old age. That would actually be kind of cool seeing an older version of the hero from Dragon Quest VIII. That actually sounds really awesome. Actually, this is the first time in five years I've been called to action. Moray came in and asked me, you see. Well, you can't turn down someone like Moray, can you? I, I put up quite a fight, though, don't you think? Yeah, if we go outside... There is now a statue! is actually really cool. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and equip... Reduces damage from fire and ice based spells <laughs> by 40 points.
We'll give it to Jessica so she stops dying every two seconds. What's so funny is that? Future self. Ooh, oh wait, no, not. That's not a good shot. All right, future self, please use this. Uh, actually, I can do it right now. Control Alt Print Screen, and let's go into Paint.ms because this has to be like one of my thumbnails for like a for like a future video on the Yub Tubs. I'm just saying this is too priceless to not have as a good as a really nice looking thumbnail. And it's so cool with like the evening horizon and stuff. Alright. Uh Monster Arena Thumbnail dot ping. It has been saved. I mean we we uh, I mean that's just that's just too perfect not to have as your thumbnail on the Yub Dubs. Did you see the statue? Statue? I was talking about for like minutes. I was maybe distracted by the Spider-Man video. Oh. Also thickly diapered in a wrong- Oh, that statue. Yeah. I saved a picky of it, so that way uh, I would remember to- Use that as a thumbnail. Yeah. Also, a thickly diapered in a, rom a romper onesie. Oh, so cute. I'm just making sure that my backup team is really good, because that'll help with, like, boss fights later on. So let's go and get Talos Dumb King. Middle. Who else do we have here? Oh yeah, probably Haxdilla. That's gonna be a pretty potent team right there. And then our other team is the one that beat, you know, the... the Might as well save my progress once again. No reason not to. Memory card slot one. And the thingy above the quib spinning in circles. Aha, uh -huh, little mobile. Probably with a light though. That way that Kawi has a night white. Yes, these. Kissy. Yay. So apparently there is a town above Pickham that we can go to, and I'll probably do this as like one of the last things we do uh, during this episode. And when I say above, I mean we're gonna need to do some flying. If we want to reach the, you use the Godbird Soul Stone. Did you see the puppy? Did you see the little foxy thing go crazy there? In the little scene. Did you see? <laughs> yeah, it would be used. <laughs> so where is this place? Supposedly. It didn't give me really good directions. It gave me horrible directions. It's like, oh, it's somewhere near this town. Good luck finding it, ass. 
Oh, thank you. Thank you. That was, uh, that was beautifully informative. And now for our least informative walkthrough. Well, that wasn't a walkthrough, to be fair. That was a random internet form, so... Close enough. Yeah. Whoa. Is that it over there? No, it's not. Uh... Oops, I didn't mean to hit that button. I wanted to hit this button. Okay. Um... Hi, Ben Golly DQA. Tyran Golly. Where is Tyran's Golly? Is somewhere around the Pickham region, probably north across all the mountains. Just look for a small. Okay, look for a small town surrounded by mountains. Do you see a town that's surrounded by mountains? And it's to the north of Pickham. Is that it? Let's actually look at a video guide, because that might be easier. Yeah, here's a five minute video that shows off the that shows the way. I know- oh, it's that town right there, okay. So provided that I can park the bird somewhere- Park the bird, that was a weird sentence. I never thought I'd have to utter. Park the bird somewhere! Ah, oh, damn. Y you know, you know, if people did- if like your neighbors or whatever just heard you like commentating on a, on a live stream, they'd probably think you need to go to like the psych ward. I'm just saying. Shit, I hit the wrong button. Okay, let's try it again. We're gonna park the bird. See, this, this is this is exactly what would make your neighbors just think. You know, I think there's a crazy person who lives in that house over there. Also, me thinks a fox is more cool than a doggy. I think, I think my puppy is super duper adorable, horrible. And my skunk kitty is super cute. Ah, no! Oh. Aww. Which way do we want to go here? Yeah, towards the... Choose a kitten. Oh, kitties are good. Uh huh. I saw puppies. Yeah.
also would Adwa like to play Pikachu? That would be fun. Pikachu. Pikachu. Also, what kind of things could be see here? Peekaboo! 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 Yay! Peekaboo! Peekaboo! Pika boob. You human are you? This is Try and Dolly. Welcome. <laughs> I think a monster just spoke to me. Saying it out right now. Then you there, uh, you're a monster, uh, but you don't fight or run away. What business do you have being so welcoming? Explain yourself. Here in Triton Gully, humans and elves and me. Monsters all live happily together. <laughs> so why would I run away when? see a human. Yeah. I... I... Well, I never. I had no idea such a place existed. Of course. You know what this means. I can wander about without causing a stir. It's a veritable paradise. Well, what are we waiting for? Come on, follow me. This scene is so silly. Also, apparently, we're now playing as the king. When I was little, I nearly fell down to the bottom of the gully. I did, it's true. And my friend swooped down and saved me. He caught me as I was falling. He's a Draki, you know. You're a monster, too. Monsters are cool. Ooh, you're a fine-looking specimen, aren't you? Oh. <laughs> that was random. What? I just wanted to know what would have happened. Oh god. Also, did you see the animations for when he picks up a barrel? How silly it is? <laughs> it's so silly! It is! Rapthorn is the Lord of Darkness, ruler of the world of darkness, but for all his might he could not control his lust for power. He came here to the world of light thinking he could reign over that too, but he was stopped by the seven great stages. They sealed him away in a huge rock somewhere in our world. What's this, a new face? Now that you've come all the way, it simply wouldn't do to miss out on uh, Tyrone Gali's most famous drink. It's called a Dry Jutini. Would you like to try one? It costs a mere nine coins. All right, thank you. One gi uh, dry jikini coming up. I'll bring it over to you right away. Here we game. This is a dry gigantini. Agitated, 
not distressed. Why don't you give it a try, sir? <laughs> Read me like a book, my good man. This is just what I was looking for. Oh, goodness. Well, well, well. I am impressed. This is delicious. Thank you, sir. You flatter me. Perhaps while you enjoy your drink, I could entertain you with a tale of triangle. As you wish, my good man. This drink is more than enough entertainment for me. <laughs> you are too kind, but please, allow me to begin. <clears throat> it all started long ago, many hundreds of years past. Oh god, this is so hard to this is so hard to take seriously when the silly animation of him still guzzling down. <laughs> Just look at this. Oh my god. Also, that's clearly liquor. Yeah. I don't know how they got away with this game being T-rated. Let's not question it. Clearly, whoever. When he found an elf and a gigant lying injured in the road. Hating to see any creature suffer, he tended to their wounds and he saved their lives. Amazed that a human should show them such kindness, they pledged their allegiance to Kupas. Yeah, T-rated. And from that day forth, the three of them were inseparable. But the lifespan of humans, elves, and monsters is very different. After many years, Kupas passed on into the great beyond. Determined to honor his dying wish, the elf and the gigant established a settlement here in the gully. And ever since then, Humans, elves, and monsters have lived here, side by side, in peace, never forgetting Kupas's wish, that no one should ever be allowed to forget how Rapthorn had terrorized the world. So, that's why the inhabitants of this valley are always sure to tell travelers about the terror of the Lord of Darkness. Well, well, that's quite a tale. Very interesting, I'm sure. But this drink is absolutely fascinating. Hmm. Well, that was delicious. It <laughs> venturing this far into the forest just for that alone. How much alcohol was in that cup that it took him that long to guzzle it all down? Thank you for your custom, sir. I wish you a pleasant journey. LOL drinking anime. I know, right? <laughs> Welcome to the gold bank. You currently have a thousand gold. I guess deposit... Yeah, actually... Oh, we have an inn. Cool. Everyone here in Tyran Gali had the fa hid the fact that uh, David was an heir to one of the great sages. Raya swore us to secrecy. She said he should only be told once he was old enough to understand. And now this has happened. It's terrible. Also, you say thank you for the drink, then smash a barrel behind the bar. Oh my God. Be right back. Mirror armor. Ooh, nice. Only we had the money for it. Mirror shield is nice as well. Power shield. Thinking cap. Ooh, you have the final piece I need. We need to get that bow. Because we're gonna, uh, we're gonna combine all the bows together to make a super bow. It'll be awesome. Dragon's Bane. Ooh.
This is a treasure chamber. You may not enter without the Raya's permission. Please leave. All right, then. Rude ass. Rude ass. Rude boy Jamaican bacon. Can't be calling the rude boy Jamaican bacon. Right. I guess for right now, there's no reason not to just dump our money. Deposit? Yeah, I'll go ahead and deposit like, I don't know, five grand in there. Cool. This church belongeth to the goddess and to me. Why ye want? Confess thy deed before the great imp. Keep I mean benevolent goddess. That way I can record your deeds in an adventure log, okay? Oh, this is so silly. Oh, this is so ridiculous right here. I think this is a good time as any, though, to go ahead and wrap up the Sweamy, because I am tired. Don't be a go on then retreat, see if I care. Oh my gosh. Let's go ahead. So, who can be hosted? Let us find out. No. Oh well. I'll just go ahead and end the squeamy. Bye bye, everyone. Have a wonderful day. See you guys later. Okay.